everyone. We just arrived to Simbri. It's extremely hot, but not complaining, loving it. I'm going to see where to grab a nice breakfast and then exchange some money and find out all the activities we can possibly do. We're definitely gonna do and visit Angkor Wat. Uh, in the upcoming three days, including all the temples surrounding the area, and see what else we can do. Yay! <laughs> Come and join us. Southeast Asia, you know, the, the buzz, the loud streets, the motorcycles and tuk-tuks all over the place. Man, I'm loving it. recommended big portions good food lovely stuff yeah come and check it out I think we will return and try something else that burrito looked incredible What's the name of that street up Guan Street up Guan Street and you find little cafes here and spas, so it's worth a visit. Well, it's a nice little uh, riverside walk. The river looks a little bit dried out, but considering the heat, it's not a surprise. And you got all these flags and uh, trees are wrapped around these colorful, colorful fabrics. I don't know if it's a holiday or something, or maybe it's just a normal occurrence here in uh, Siem Reap. But oh my god, it's so hot today. I can't even describe how hot it is. I'm absolutely boiling. Happy New Year! I don't know if this decoration has been left since uh, January or it's a Buddhist New Year. I guess we'll find out. But uh, there you go. Happy New 2023. I don't know if you can see it guys, but there are so many bats in these trees. We are in front of the royal residence here in Siem Reap. It looks quite grand, beautiful. But yeah, there's no way you're going to get inside, I suppose. Wow, what a lovely market. And it's so nice to hide from the sun here. So if you're boiling outside, come and check it out. Cool down a bit. You're such a big boy. You're such a big boy. Are you not hurt? I'm sure it's hot. You're not hurt. <laughs>
Located near the old market, the Buddhist temple of Wat Preya Prom Ra is one of the oldest temples in Siem Reap. Built at the end of the 15th century, this beautiful temple is a must-see if you are in the city center. It doesn't look big from the outside, but once you step in, you will find many beautifully decorated pagodas, lecture halls and Buddha statues. Like most Buddhist temples in Cambodia, Wat Preya Prom Ra welcomes visitors. There is no entrance fee, but donations are recommended. This is a working temple with monks dormitories, so dress appropriately and take off your shoes if you come inside the hall. Some monks at the temple speak English and many travelers visit this temple independently, although hiring a guide or joining a tour can add important cultural context. Wat Preya Prom Ra is open to visitors throughout the daylight hours, but mid-afternoon is generally a good time to visit if you would like to talk to the monks. In the evening we went to check out the pub street. This is the place of entertainment, loud music and numerous bars offering happy hour cocktails. Like I said, much better than kombucha. Very refreshing and they've got many flavors to choose from. So pop into the brewery and get yourself some daily probiotics. And now we're going to check this uh, nail place where hopefully I can get a nice pedicure done, followed by a nice spa where we can book our massages for later today. And we're going to pop in and visit Pagoda and the temple not too far from our hostel. Like a French manicure color mm -hmm. to start with. They're quite short. It's an art to cross a street here in Siem Reap. It doesn't matter if it's a green light, red light, they're just driving. And it doesn't matter if you're crossing on the zebra crossing or not. You just have to start walking yeah. and 
hope pray, for the best. pray that no one's going to hit you. You just need to be confident, make a move, and then hope for the best. You really need yeah. to be careful because it's an organized chaos. That's the only way I can describe that. Wat Bo Pagoda is located just one kilometer away from Pop Street area, and it is in an ideal location to go and explore on your own. This 18th century temple is one of the oldest known Buddhist temples in Siem Reap. Inside the main temple, there are paintings which date back from the 19th century and are still in a very good condition today. Although it is a Buddhist temple, some of the wall paintings describe the famous ancient love story of Rama and Shita, the strongest man and the most beautiful woman of all time. Still today, the royal families of Southeast Asian countries claim to be descendants of Rama. A good time to visit the temple is between 4.30 and 6 p.m., when you will often hear the monks chanting. There is also a small school here, living quarters for the monks, beautiful gardens and some nice places to sit and relax in the shade of the trees. And here we are at Corona Spa, going to have one hour warm oil massage. massage and uh, it's really good and it's quite affordable as well if we had more time here I think we would come back for more I loved it so the spa called Corona Spa I actually I saw so many nice treatments on the spa menu yeah definitely come and pay a visit we're leaving tomorrow it was a lovely finish to our stay in Siem Reap I love Siem Reap obviously Angkor Wat and all the other temples around they were amazing and Definitely recommend to do the three days tour, but just prepare yourself. It's going to be hot, so you will need lots of cold water to cool down. If you haven't already, we encourage you to watch the videos from our trip to the incredible Angkor Park. The links will be in the description below.